everyone, welcome back. Um, so today, let's see, I can get this a little closer. It's more focused on the poster. Does that seem okay? Um, so this week we have been focusing on the book Hair Love. All right, and we've been practicing sequencing events. So the first day you listened to the story and you did your summary. The second day we completed the first two parts together and your job was to complete the last two parts. So I want to remind you that there was um, three steps I did to work on sequencing hair love. So let me put here sequencing events of a story. All right, and when we were sequencing the events, we first looked in the book. We did a picture walk of the stories where we just tried to work on remembering what was happening by turning the pages and just saying a little bit about the book. So the first thing I'm going to put here is number one, do a picture walk. Okay. So then after a little picture. So look in the book. After we did a five finger retail on our fingers. where we, without the book, just tried to remember what happened first, next, then, and last. And after thinking about what happened in the book, with the picture walk and with the five finger ring tail, we were then ready to write about the book. So number three, write. The sequence of events. Their worksheet is a little prettier than my picture here, but we try our best. I'll draw a little pencil. So these steps will help prepare you for the writing portion. So now it is your turn. We have listened to a story and summarized it. We have done the sequence of events for Hero Love. But in your packets, in the manila envelopes that you picked up from Horace Mann, not only did I have um, your reading packets, your math packets, those little books, um, you had actual books to read too. So now it's your turn to either use one of the books I put in your envelope, or if you'd rather use a Raz Kid book, use a Raz Kid book, and then use the other side of your worksheet, that's page four. Page four, to do your own sequence of your own story and then turn it into me either on seesaw or you can have your parents take a picture and message it to me as well all right have a great day